prompts. When we, when we ask, what do you do? This is, of course, for you. If we speak about another person, what does he do? What does she do? We can also ask this question about an object. This is a marker. What does it do? What does it do? What does a marker do? A marker, a marker, writes. Markers write. Markers write, a marker writes. That's what it does. That's what they do. Markers, they, one marker, it. Great. So this is very simple, but let's talk about some, some mistakes that people usually make with these simple things and these simple rules and some other rules that we have. Like when we want to talk about what we do, we can say, uh, we can say, I work as a teacher. Can we say, I work like a teacher? No, it means something different. It's different. I work as a teacher. This means I am a teacher and I do the work of a teacher. If I say I work like a teacher, it means I'm not a teacher and my work is similar to a teacher, to a teacher's work. I work like a teacher, right? Like for example, what does a consultant do? A consultant works like a teacher, a consultant teaches people, they consult people sometimes, right? Or a trainer, trainer works like a teacher. So, uh, right, this is something similar, but it's not a teacher. And this is, this is important too, because um, so in some languages and in some places, when you study at a university, and you finish your education, then you say, I am a doctor, for example. Someone studies for four years, uh, pre-med, before medicine, they, before becoming a doctor, right? They study the first part of becoming a doctor. It's their first year of university and, and someone says, oh, what do you do? They should say, I'm a student. I'm studying to be a doctor, right? Uh, but, but sometimes these people answer and they say, I'm a doctor. But it's their first year of university. They're not a doctor, right? Or, uh, or another example, somebody studies at university for four years to be an engineer. After these four years, this person cannot find a job as an engineer a job as an engineer, but, uh, but this person finds a job as a teacher. And someone asks, what do you do? It's not correct to say, I'm an engineer. He doesn't have a job as an engineer. He has a job as a teacher. He's a teacher, right? He studied to be an engineer or he studied as an engineer or he studied so, so we could say something else about this, but we don't say that he is an engineer if he doesn't have a job as an engineer, if he doesn't work as an engineer. So education and, and profession are different, right? Um, great. A person who, a person who paints pictures, what do we call this? Okay, so so usually what we how we think of it is artist is very, very, very general. Yes. Like many, many things can be art. And a person who makes this art is an artist, right? So for example, people who, who dance, there's a choreographer who organizes this dance, right? And so choreography is like an art 
and this choreographer is a type of artist and the dancers might be like artists, right? Uh, art, artists can be a, bi a very big term, like a musician, a singer. These are artists also. They have a different type of art. Their art is music, right? So, uh, so yeah, so painter is specific about one type of artist, a person who paints like Picasso, right? We, so usually when we read something about Picasso, it says the famous painter, Picasso. Yes, he's also an artist. And, and yes, he's also a famous artist. But if we speak specifically about his art form, then we can say that he's a painter, right? Drawer, this is an interesting word. We don't, we don't say it a lot. A person who draws, but yes, they they could be a drawer. Uh, we might also use words like sketch. And when we don't have a good person word, a good word about the person who does this thing, then we can always add the word artist. So a person who sketches, um, to, to sketch is like to draw something basic, to draw the first version of something, right? Uh, so a sketch artist might create this. Then you also have comedy sketches, a sketch in a comedy, right? And this is also a sketch artist, and, but they're also a comedian. Right? So sometimes it's difficult to understand how to create the word of the person who does this thing. Like, for example, we have comedian, but comedy. Comedy and comedian. The, the stress, the stress and the word changes. Right. Another good example of this is politics, political, and politician. Politics, political. Politician. It changes in each of these words, right? Politics is this general idea, this general topic, right? Uh, someone can study this at the university. What did you study? I studied politics. I studied history. I studied geology, geography, politics, right? It's a subject. Political is an adjective about politics. And politician is the man or person, man or woman who engages in politics, who does politics, right? Great, okay. Who are some other important people? We have, for example, a person who designs is a designer. How many different kinds of designers can you think of? 